Hey guys, welcome back to So Rachel Lustig. Today I'll be making a fun rocket blasting game, so let's get started. But uh, we need to pick a backdrop. Uh, stars. We are gonna use this. We don't need this cat, of course. We need the um rocket ship. The rock. The button. This too. And next, we need to paint a sprite. Let's go into the text. Change it to pixel. Let's change this to that. And type. Game over. We need a this sprite right here and make it big. I guess I could make it a little smaller. So, yeah. So now that we have made this cool came over sprite, let's get coming to the rocket or the um button. And we are actually going to name this button sprite into laser of course because we need that so we are going to do first a one flag clicked a set size to wait, wait no set size to 10 so this would be size 10. Let's go into hide. And also we need um, a, um, yep, go to front layer. Then we need to, um, when I receive message one, and let's make a new message named game. Oh. Okay, when I receive game over, we need it to create a clone of myself. And when we need, wait a sec, actually, I actually for when I receive game over, put the stop all thing and change it to other, stop other scripts in the sprite. Then we need now we're gonna leave this create a clone of myself block here because you'll need a when space key is pressed block and put this underneath then we also need a when oops a when i start as clone block we needed to um go to we need this block and name it to negative 160 and put this backdrop of stage block Be and we need to change the second one to rocket ship and um, wide position and we need a show block repeat until block and a t touching edge block then we need it to move at least 10 steps Delete this clone. All the code is okay. Well, we are of course changing this um size of the rocket ship to fifty, of course, because it's too big. And now change the direction by here. Okay. 
So we need um, 180 actually, so that it faces this way. Great. Then we can uh, code it. So, okay, now that we've set the rocket ship, let's just do the game over sprite and game over. Yep, let's do the game over sprite and let's do one flag click and a when I receive game over. So for this one, we need hide. And for this one, we need show and we need a sound called lose. Yeah, we need play sound to lose until done and also a stop all block. And this is like, yeah, right now it's not working out because how the fat is hiding, of course. And now this laser is working and the game over is hidden for now. This, then we can code the rocket ship now. So for this, we need a, um, when I receive game over, we need it to uh, stop other scripts and sprite. Uh, we need one flag clicked. We need to make a variable name. We need to actually make two. We need one name score and another name speed. So we're going to set um, score to zero and we need um, set size to at least 50. 50. Well, first about the variable, now that you see these two, let's uncheck the speed because we don't want to see that variable. Then we need that, then we need um, go to x negative um negative 178 to negative 5 then we need repeat until touching rocks touching rocks and then we need a um, key, wait, wait. yeah, um, if then here and then if then underneath. And then we need um, key, um, up arrow and key, down arrow. Then we need change y by 10 and change y by negative 10. So that's all the code is. Now look. Uh, but now it's not still working with the rock cause um, it's not exactly done yet. Yeah. So we can of course change this to 50 because it's too big. Yeah, so first we need a one flag clicked. Show. Set size to 50. Repeat at least five times. create a clone of myself and then we need a hide block okay then we need one I'm just going to take the when I receive game over er, 
Um, when I receive game over, stop all the skips in the sprite. Next, here is the tricky part. We will be doing. Next, we need when I start as clone as a clone. We need a um go to X and we just to let you know if you're making this game use a computer otherwise the game won't work because you need the up and down arrows to move the rocket around um the rocket would move up and down with your thing and if it's not working if that's not work if that if you're using like an ipad or a touch like tablet or anything it won't actually work it, the, you can't move the, the rocket up and down. So we need 240. And then we need a um, pick random. Pick random 150. I mean, pick random negative 150 through 150. So then we need set set speed let me we could just duplicate duplicate that block and we could of course change it to negative two through negative six and then we need a repeat until block Sensing repeat until touching rocket ship. Okay, then we need change X by speed. Then we need we need an Yes. So then we need an if then block underneath that and an if then block underneath this and we are going to go this. We're going to put this block if um x position in is greater than if this is greater than Two hundred negative two hundred and twenty. We need it to. Next, we need um a go to um so we can at least drag this underneath this, and of course we need this one too. So we could change this to negative two forty through. Wait, yeah, 240 through negative 76. We need it to, um, then we need um, the second one to be 240. And then we need to, we could duplicate this again. Just duplicate that block. Put that underneath. Put that underneath there so that, um, you could, um, because we don't have to do that. Then we need this second if then block, if then um, touching laser. We wanted to um, change um, change score by, you can change, pick whatever you want, but I'm gonna do 45. Then you could do, um, then you have to do Go to X, um, 240, 40, and then we need, wait, actually, an easier way is just duplicating the block, and then we could, of course, delete all this, and then we can use this because that's much easier than just remaking that. 
then we needed to do a sound call wait, wait, sounds magic spell magic spell so this is the sound by the way so um, next we need to go into sounds and start sound magic spell yeah so then we need start sound magic spell and then we need um broadcast game over and this is all the code there is so this is how the game works and it's game over this way and this is how they make score points so thanks for watching bye i hope you like this video and if you want to try to you can make this game at home and thanks for watching bye